Now this is you can see this is the Ubuntu 22.10 Kinetic Kudu GNOME 43 version. So this is the uh, Ubuntu new release. This is uh, this is the short term release of course supported till 9 months and this is the uh, this is the interface of the gnome 43 now we'll talk about the major changes that that means the, the what are the main uh, changes here so just uh, i'm showing you the first change is actually here uh, when you see here in the drop down menu now this drop down menu has been changed and now you can see some toggle button set has been introduced here so you can see uh, this is the, to the wired connection so if you click this then it will be off and you, if you click again it will be on so just off on button just like uh, android android drop down menu and also a uh, two per um, mode of uh, balance and power saver and uh, when you go to the actually power settings in the settings manager and in the real hardware you will also get another option of uh, performance mode and also night light and dark mode and light mode so just click dark mode for that you can see this is the dark mode i'm just showing you guys you can see this is the dark mode and this is light mode right so th so that's the thing and also you can see uh, this the a shortcut has been uh, introduced here uh, of the default screenshot tool when you click here so this is the default uh, screenshot tool of the gnome desktop so uh, you can take a screenshot you just click this or you can see some uh, screencast also but not that effective so you just click here you can see this is the video this is the picture so if you click so you can take the screenshot right and also uh, this is the battery option okay and all the things and this is the uh, the power option to log out or shut down the uh, system and and now another thing is about the nautilus file manager so you can see this is my uh, nautilus file manager and uh, uh, this is the uh, a lot of a lot of improvements has been done here and you can see the look has been changed now this is the 43 version right and uh, when you actually uh, when uh, a less space is available so it will uh, goes like this so the side panel disappears and you can uh, reappear this uh, like this when you click in this icon the side panel appears and also some properties you just uh, click properties and this is also changed right so all the GNOME uh, changes I have also mentioned in the Fedora um, 37 uh, video. So you must check that also. Okay, so if, if uh, I'm doing the uh, these things, so this is the rubber band selection. It is much easier right now. So like these things are in the Nautilus file manager. Okay, and now I'm going to the settings. So I'm going to the settings and here and here you will see that as uh, a uh, very uh, nice uh, uh, wallpapers um, here used so i'm just showing you guys that very very uh, cool wallpapers this is the kinetic kudu wallpapers you can see that's very very nice wallpapers to look at okay for light and dark theme you can use these wallpapers this is really nice kinetic code wallpapers right all right now i'm just showing you guys and in the appearance section you can also change the accent colors of course so uh, you can change the accent accent colors are uh, now more uh, looking good actually and if i click here you can see the blue accent color now icons turns blue you can see right so accent colors are blue all right and also uh, uh, you can see the ubuntu desktop this is uh, another setting this is another addition so ubuntu desktop settings basically this uh, will uh, control the desktop uh, settings that means whatever in the desktop okay the size of the uh, icons in the desktop right like uh, uh, the the home or the, the installer here you can see these are the icons hmm, okay so that that things you can see 
so size normal or you can say large so you can see some large larger icons you will get and so personal folders and auto hide doc you can auto hide the doc right so when just click here it will auto hide and panel mode actually so if you disable panel mode so he, he, you will get like this this is the nice doc and if you prefer panel mode just like ubuntu unity so you can click that and also icon size you can change from here okay so you can change the icon size and uh, all right and position on the screen just left uh, and also you can switch to right and all these things available left is good of course <laughs> this is the traditional way and now another thing uh, i'm just uh, mentioning here if i open uh, suppose file manager here and another window suppose i'm opening so new window so now i have two windows right so i have two separate windows now another application suppose suppose libreoffice i'm just opening just libreoffice and the latest uh, almost latest uh, libreoffice you will see here uh, 7.4 version you can see 7.0 i'm just showing you guys so this is the 7.4 version you can see the libreoffice so total in total i have uh, total three windows and when you click activity or um, or hit the windows key button or the super button so you will get uh, this this nice look and you can uh, sw switch from one desktop to another uh, virtual desktop but one main thing is that suppose I'm clicking this Nautilus file manager here. You can see now you will see only those two windows having the Nautilus file manager. This will appear. So this is really nice uh, thing, and this is just like the thing as uh, we are getting in the uh, Ubuntu Unity desktop. Okay, traditionally. Okay, in earlier days, um, I have um, largely used this uh, this thing. This is really helpful uh, for your workings so when multiple windows are open so you just click in the icon uh, in the in the panel so only that uh, application windows will be open so that's a really nice thing and now going to the settings again just i'm just showing you guys so this is the these are the settings so all settings are well known uh, gnome settings right so power display and all the things you can change the refresh rate from here and you can see the about section and you can see this is the <coughs> actually this is gnome version 43.0 and x11 uh, the default uh, windowing system not well in, in the ubuntu okay so so uh, and that's uh, that's the things in this uh, new release Okay, this is a short term release. You can upgrade it if you have uh, Ubuntu 22.04. So you can just upgrade it to get the latest softwares and latest features of the GNOME 43 desktop. So that's uh, the news for today. Or you can see this is the review. Okay, if you like the video, then hit the like button. And of course, subscribe my channel, hit the notification bell icon to get um, notified of my future videos. So thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next video very soon. Till then. Take care and goodbye.